intro to business through chemistry. Two topics that don't really go hand in hand. <coughs> However, for me and my family, these two topics have always gone hand in hand. Hi, my name is Nuyasi. Today, I'm going to talk about my introduction to business through chemistry. Firstly, to give context about my family. My grandfather started one of the first fragrance companies in Bangladesh before the Liberation War, as he found that this was something that the nation lacked. Through this, he made sure that his son, my father, my uncle, and recently my cousin was also part in this business, as he made sure that it was a family-involved third-generation business. So for me, chemistry held a sweet spot. Chemistry meant a lot to me. So as you may believe, growing up living with family members such as my uncle, my dad, and my grandfather were heavily involved in the family business, my passion and willingness to work in this line grew a lot and a lot. So today, I'll be talking to you about my passion and how my passion came through one simple chemistry project. My, my first chemistry project, or chemistry, un understanding of chemistry, started in ninth grade, where I had to pick my course selection for the, tenth, for the upcoming year. When I saw chemistry, I vividly remembered promising my grandfather at the age of six that I'd be doing chemistry and I'd be a member of the third generation looking into the family business. So, as chemistry was one of my core subjects, I was certain that I was going to take it. Was I nervous? Yeah, but also a little bit clueless. However, my sheer passion of wanting to make the promise come true lit a fire inside of me, as I wanted to do everything in, the, in my part to make that promise come true. Fast forward a few summatives, a few assignments, a few concerts being done, and then a summative in the second semester, a summative unlike any other. A summative in which me and a partner had to create, had to create a product that through the means of chemical reaction would make the content inside cooler or warmer. An example is a hot pack, or ice pack. Through chemical reaction, through chemical reaction, a hot pack and ice pack generates heat or makes the thing colder to help treat the injuries. So we had to make our own product. Fortunately enough, I had a partner. I had my friend Kalela that helped me with this project. When we started, it was a bit rough. However, when we started, when we worked on, we decided that I should be looking into the logistics of the product itself, while my partner would look into the aesthetics and the design of the product. Even though we didn't have a proper understanding of what we were about to do, we had some ideas. And then we had a rough idea to make a product that would make the content inside cooler. And we named it Twister. So to briefly explain Twister, it was a product that by twisting would make the content inside cooler. This is a rough draft of Twister. Rough indeed. However, we did have an idea. We wanted to push this idea. We wanted to test the boundaries. We wanted to see how we could make this better and how it was operating in a niche market. So, we ran our ideas with Twister. We looked at how it could be optimized in the best way possible, how it could be aesthetic, how we would probably, how we would uh, bring customers to buy this product itself. So after we looked, after we looked into the first design, we decided that Kalala should further work on the design and make it aesthetically pleasing, and I'd look into the limitation this product may have, the profit margin, how this would work in the general demographic, how this could be helpful in, Bang in a country like Bangladesh, and how this product has not been found or been found anywhere else before. While researching, a sudden realization hit me that this product, and or pitching this idea to the class, was something that my family had been doing for generations on end. And that lit that fire inside of me again. As for the first time in my life, I was able to do something that my family had been doing for generations on end. As for the first time, I was able to finally resonate with, my, with the promise that I had made to my grandfather, with what my father has been doing for every single day, and what my uncle and my cousin recently have been doing. So that made me research even more and more. And that made me research in the core business aspects, such as the environmental safety, CSR, limitation drawbacks, which are all considered a, which are all considered a core of a business company. As essentially, if this project would be created, we would have to further investigate profit margin, some elements of safety that need to be considered while the product is being made. So while looking into this, we realized that we were successful. As after looking into the product, how the product would work, and the chemical reaction, me and Kalala were able to make our final draft, our, and the final model of Twister itself. So on the left-hand side is how the bottle itself would operate. The left hand side shows the calculations for how the twister bottle would make the twister would make the content inside cooler. To, to explain, there's an outside layer on the bottle that would contain ammonium nitrate and water, which if mixed together would would make a cooling sensation into the drink inside. So on the left hand side are the calculations. 
on the right hand side shows how many grams of ammonium nitrate we would require to make the content inside cooler. As we wanted to make the content or the drink or the beverage inside cold, however we didn't, we didn't want to make it too cold or too warm as we're living in a country like Dhaka, which suffers quite a lot from heat. So we realized that by inserting 60 grams of ammonium nitrate, we will be able to drop the temperature of the water all the way down to 3.6 degrees. This is where we found success. As the logistics were running great, and my partner gave me a great design, as this was our final draft. Final model of Twister. The left hand shows the chemical reaction, how the ammonium nitrate mixes with water to make the content inside colder, and how the product itself would work, while the right hand shows how the product itself would look, like a looping, or the model of a product. But that shows how the water or the content inside would be colder in general. After presenting this class, me and my partner were delighted with the grade with the grade we got, and we had a sense of joy and also a sense of pride. However, I felt more accomplished due to one one small reason. It's because for the first time in my life, I've been able to do what my family have been doing for generations at end. For the first time in my life, I was able to connect. For the first time in my life, I felt successful while doing chemistry. As I found, as after this, I found myself inquiring more about the family business, asking more questions, trying to go to the office itself and find out about how our operations work. As I wanted to, be, as I want, as I saw myself working there in the future. So the message that I want to showcase to you guys is that through nurturing your passion today, you can start and reach that dream. As through my passion for chemistry and business, I hope to be successful like the past generations and hope to be a member of the third generation of this family business. Thank you so much.